they change over time, sometimes for the best, mm -hmm. sometimes for the worse. Yeah. yeah. The record-breaking Broadway revival of Merrily We Roll Along follows the friends played by Lindsay Mendez, Jonathan Groff, and Daniel Radcliffe through three decades. Yeah, this is quite the show, and it's no question this is uh, a big hit. Take a look. We've got a short fire, genuine walkaway blockbuster, lies out to Broadway, the full of sensational box office, Lollapalooza, gargantuan. It's a hit, it's a hit, it's a hit, it's a hit, it's a hit. It's a hit. It's a hit. All right. It's like I'm there again. <laughs> <laughs> Front row seats. Katie Rose Clark plays Beth Shepard, the wife of Jonathan Groff's character, but you may recognize her as the ever so popular Glinda in Wicked. And she is joining us live this morning, so please welcome to New York Living, Katie Rose Clark. Here come the doors. There you go. How are you? Hello, gorgeous. So good to see you. Great to see you. Welcome, welcome. Oh, and you smell nice, too. <laughs> Thank you. Because yeah. he doesn't. Well, you know. um, can we get the Broadway star some aguita, please? Yes, Poor woman little... is parched. Oh, thank you. How are you? I'm very well. How are you? Doing well. Oh, good. Um, now that you're here. Thank yeah. you. So we found, we uncovered, because we are serious journalists here, mm -hmm. something interesting happened during your callback. Oh, yes. For this show. Would you mind sharing yes. with friends and family? Yes. So um, I had my audition for Merrily, and during... Uh, what I've been sharing that people may not know is that I was actually nine months pregnant huh? when I had my audition for Merrily. So um, when I came in for my callback, I was very much having contractions, regular <laughs> contractions. <laughs> so I wasn't actually supposed to go into full labor, so mm -hmm. my husband and I were kind of timing them to make sure that it wasn't something I needed to go to the hospital for. I mean, it was not actual, like, full-out labor, but we were But water was broken. It. No, water hadn't broken, but I was having regular enough contractions that we were really watching it. And then I had my baby two days after my callback. So, yeah, it was like a false labor, I think is what they mm -hmm. call it. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah, thank God it, it all, you know, stayed in there. Palpitations. <laughs> yeah. Oh, well, thank goodness you got the part. No kidding. <laughs> yes, I thank you so much. I, I think the same thing. I thank God they could see past my big pregnant belly and everything else go. that was going on. Yeah. That, that is no more. That's talented. Obviously. Seriously. I could barely get out a sentence when I was going into labor. This one's auditioning <laughs> oh, for no, no, the no. great one. Well, way. again, it wasn't full out labor. Okay. Like, I mean, oh, it was. Yeah, we're seeing we just watching kids? it. Oh, yes, four. I have three sure. kids. Yep. Yep. There you go. Eleanor, Jack, and Mabel. Beautiful. Yeah. Uh, Unbelievable. And that was in the rehearsal room for Merrily right there. Yeah. Oh, my God. I brought them to rehearsal. Yeah, they would come up kind of between, like on a dinner break or something yeah. on the weekend. My my husband mm -hmm. would bring them up. So yeah. Well, let's talk about Merrily. I mean, this is Stephen Sondheim. Yes. It uh, one of the most prolific of all time on Broadway, right? Yes. And you get to sing one of the most popular songs of his too, which is "Not a Day Goes By." Mm -hmm. So not only to be in the show, but to sing his lyrics. Yeah. For you as a performer and an artist, what yeah. is that like? Uh, it's it's such an honor and such a thrill. I mean, what's such a What's so wonderful about it is it's the kind of material that you can just really rest in and trust. There's no like, you know, there's no negotiating or filling in the blanks as the actor or the performer to tell the story. You just really can trust that, you know, Sondheim is the smartest person in the room, you know? And so you can just really, really live in it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I love, first of all, it's stunning to watch. Mm -hmm. Just the set alone is beautiful. Mm -hmm. oh, and, yeah. you know, I'm a sporty spice, but I'm a sucker for fashion. Oh, I loved come on. seeing the transformation through all the different decades, the 50s, the 60s, the 70s. Which, yes. which era was your favorite? Gosh, I love that question, and it's so hard for me to choose. The 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 outfit that I wear for the 70s era is kind of this pants mm -hmm. suit looking moment for Not a Day Goes By, and mm -hmm. I do love that look. I love the 70s. Um, but you know, the 50s dresses with the, you know, <laughs> it, it is also really fun. I have a lot of the 50s looks because I, I meet them yes. when they're quite young at yeah. the beginning yeah. of their friendship. So yes. I come in for that era a lot. Yes. Yeah, for those who don't know, I guess just give me a quick little synopsis of the show, right? Yeah, so this tracks the friendship of the three, um, Jonathan, Lindsay, and Dan. Um, those three, their characters, uh, their friendship over the course of several years, So, it, but it re works in reverse. So we start sort of at kind of the end, sort of the breakdown of those friendships, and you kind of watch it 
play back and sort oh, of wow. how it mm -hmm. happened and you kind of at the in the end of the play you sort of see the origin and how they've met and how this sort of rich friendship began yeah it's it's wonderful but and at I the beginning they're they're falling apart uh, at the when beginning of the them, play, at the beginning of the evening, the audience sees yeah. them falling apart, right? right. Yeah. And then you work. Okay. <laughs> that is us. Uh, okay. They also did not ask us to play the part of anchor man and anchor woman because that figures <gasps> prominently. And it, oh it my God. Can you talk to somebody? <laughs> yes, let me. I can. Let me put in a word. Please. Mm -hmm. There was the serious newsman. This is what we were born and for. The, these roles. Oh my goodness. And the set dressing. So you're the serious <laughs> newsman. All right. I'm I know what to do. <laughs> I'll put I in mean, a word. Could you? Could you? I will. All right. This is yeah. your fifth Broadway show. Yes, oh my gosh, and pinch me. And you hold the record for Broadway's longest running Glinda in Wicked. Mm -hmm. Is that wild? Excuse you. Yeah, thank you so much. <laughs> um, that's wild. You know, I didn't even know that until I was being introduced for something else. And I, and that was part of my intro at one yeah. point. And I, and I was like, maybe we should check that fact. I don't know if that's actually true. Where's the true. fact checker? <laughs> where's but it where's is, the right exactly. If it's on this paper, it's yeah. factual. No, it is, it's true, and yeah. And that, uh, to this, to my own surprise, actually. To your own surprise, and not only that, Lindsay Mendez, your castmate in Marilyn, yes, played your alphabet. Yes, she was one of my alphabets. That's how that's how we became close friends uh, yeah. over ten years ago. Now, look at this. Look at these yeah. people. Look at you animals. Yeah, exactly. Very serious. And Carol, they Kane. study the craft. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Carol Kane <laughs> there as Morrible. Wow. Yeah. Oh wow. Very sweet. That was over ten years ago, and yeah. now here we are on Broadway together again, and just also close friends. We yeah. have kids the same age, and. Yeah, she's she's become a dear friend over the years. And you left and oh, returned the to the part, right? I have gone back to the role uh, many times. Yeah, um, th thankfully they're they're really loyal, and mm. I have a really great relationship with that team. And it's such an incredible show. I mean, I don't yeah. know if you've seen Wicked, but I'm so proud that I'm yeah. a part of its legacy. Like eight times. Oh really? <laughs> he wants to audition. Maybe for that you as saw well. me. That would be fun. I think fun. I did see you. Yes, oh. I definitely did. I mean, the longest run, I definitely did. I, if uh, you ask him, he says, "Yeah, Kate, she, we locked eyes." Yeah. <laughs> We yeah. definitely had a moment. Well, yeah, I used to, yeah. <laughs> I yeah. can't do the front row, it. though. Can we talk about that for a second? The yeah. front row seat. Yeah. Of a Broadway it, show? You know, you think it's the best, but it's actually not. I, it's oh, like I if totally you're sitting think like this. Like this. I yeah. totally. Where's your yeah. favorite place to sit? Like like bat, a rear orchestra or the first row mezzanine. Same. Yeah. First first row mezzanine. That's yeah. it for me. Yeah. yeah. That's well, the place. You two want to go on on a. What if you want? Let's go on a date. <laughs> We're going on a date. We're going on a date to I'll a show. I'll style the two of you. You guys. You'd be great for first show. row mezzanine because every time she goes to a show, she goes. You know, the guy with the top hat sat in front of me. Well, oh. Very true. Yeah. yeah. It is. See, I yeah. You got to be careful. Out. I'm we. <laughs> so it's it's a tough. So my mom is also. The whole. Mm -hmm. In fact, for your show, I did. A, I did, I was almost in the, the oh, aisle, yeah. but it was fantastic. Oh, good. Um, so, uh, Wicked is going to be a, a full feature film. Yeah. Yes. Have you all seen the trailer? Oh my Hello. Rendering oh. the Super Bowl. Yeah. Yeah. Of yeah, course. Thoughts on this. Everybody thought. Thoughts on this. Oh my God, I'm thrilled for it. It mm -hmm. looks. It's so fun to see a new sort of idea and take yeah. an artistic view of it. It's I was fangirl beyond when I saw the trailer. I have a question about the trailer. I'm just yeah. curious about it. Because she directed it and because produced it. Yeah, in the trailer editors. for the movie, you see a shot of the Wizard of Oz and, and the and Dorothy and the and the scarecrow. But yeah. that thought this was before them. Oh, oh right, right, right. Wow. This That's, is how my wheels yeah, were yeah. spinning. Hey, you you know? know, and it makes me wonder how they've structured it yeah. in the storytelling. Oh right? my gosh. You, you guys. know what? Let's let's get these people on. Like Emma on the horn. You know, can we call Let's Cynthia? talk to them. We to have get, some questions about the wicked trailer. Questions, <laughs> sirs. Some continuity <laughs> questions, if you might. I just had a question. I just I was wondering. I, you know what? Get it just Jonathan looks Bailey beautifully. Look how it's shot. I mean, it Beautiful. looks. I'm pre, I'm very excited for it. Yeah. So you're gonna run, not walk. Oh yeah, 100. percent It's and a your, special. Your children are fully aware of who you are mm -hmm. and what you do, and no. that you're a bit no. No. Uh, no. Yeah. No. Yeah. I think my my oldest daughter knows that I was Glinda, but I don't even think that yeah. she understands yeah. that at all. Or, yeah. But I have pictures like in my bubble dress, like holding her, you uh, know, she, when she was a baby. Yeah. And so she gets it yeah. a little. Yeah. yeah. They keep us grounded. Oh yours, gosh. mine, and yours. They keep mm -hmm. us grounded. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Sure do. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much.